Hello everyone. I wanted to show you something I just got working that I don't know if everybody knows about this capability. It was uh, shown at the expo, so I got interested in trying to do it. So here's my brand new Raspberry Pi 2 I just got set up. Just sitting on the floor, <laughs> kind of dangerous. But uh, I'm going to move it before the kids get home. And I've got a projector set up right here just to test it's got the HDMI port coming out of the Pi up here to the projector and I'm going to run a virtual matrix so if you look over here on the computer I don't know if that's readable or not but basically you go to the uh, other go to input output other page you hit add set the virtual matrix I've got this set up for uh, width of 176, height of 96, just because I saw someone else did that for the one they were doing, so I figured I'd test with the same settings. And then over on E1.31, I added 100 universes. I've got it running, got the FPP running multicast. Over on the status page, you can see I'm receiving data. I've got it set in bridge mode. I'll lower that now over in X lights. I've got the same thing. I went in and set up a uh, 100, 512 sized uh, E1.31 universes, pointed to the IP address of the FPP. And over here on the sequencer page, I set up a couple of effects. And I don't want to hit play, I just want to click on the effect and get that effect running. And now if you look up there on my wall, you can see that projector is displaying that effect real time up on the wall for me. So you could actually have, have a projector displaying X-Lights effects, you know, for your shows. So if I go in and, uh, let's say I go in here and change the color, make it red and blue, I'll go to that marquee and change him to blue also. And, Look up here, and now the colors are changing. I'll leave it, leave it up there. Add white in to that marquee. Add white into that pinwheel. So you pretty much get real-time feedback. So you can almost be playing around in your house, projecting effects, you know, with your projector, and not even have to have any kind of display element set up just to play around and look at things. So, anyways, I thought that was pretty cool. I wanted everybody to check it out. Thanks.